A little more complex version of test delivery can include grouping of items. You've probably heard the phrase, there's safety in groups. Sometimes you can connect your items and keep them all together by using the group construct. I'm going to add a group uh, to the bottom of my screen. And you can see here inside of the group, it says drag header items here, drag question items here. So a header item, I'll move this uh, up so that we can see it with some of the items we've already created. But a header item may be something that doesn't have a question, like a content item uh, would be could be considered a header item. Uh, an image item could be considered a header item. So we'll drag this up to the top and this will make a little bit more sense. So let's say for my sort item, I always want this fleet, please fill in the questions to the best of your ability associated to a sort item. I could drag it into the header and I could do the same thing with this image, drag it in here. So this group item is always going to make sure that those two pieces of content are delivered together. Now if I want my sort item included, I drag that into the question. And now if any randomization is done, if anything is done, these will always stay together. They are a group delivered together. They're separate entities in the sense that I could delete the content and add something else. I could delete the image and add something else but they're always going to be delivered together. So a group is kind of a safety net to keep content uh, together uh, from page breaks and, and other things that uh, you might want to keep it away from. So the group item, a more complex version of test delivery, but can be very handy if you have multiple pieces that make up an item. Another good example might be, I always present this um, uh, content at the top that says a story or something like that. It presents a use case and you have 18 questions that follow it, you want to make sure those are grouped together. So if there is a page break, it repeats that content item. 